this video is going to be like kind of weird, kind of a very bad idea, but um, I accidentally lit this nail on fire when I was trying to lay my mom's birthday cake because the rest of my nails are like this long, except this one fell off. So I thought it would be a good idea for some reason to light all my nails on fire and see what happened because I'm gonna take these off anyway because if you can't tell they're looking ratchet as hell. Um, this one is literally a shank. <laughs> so I think it's like unsafe not to take them off. Also, don't try this at home kids. Just want to make that clear. Do as I say, not as I do. Okay, so I have water right here and then five candles took me a while to count that i'm not very good at counting so my plan is to light all of my acrylic nails on fire because they're flammable and i didn't know that when i got them so i'm gonna light all of them on fire and see what happens and then blow them out and put them in this water and then take them off and then probably put them back on with an eight dollar nail kit from target so yeah um also this is what my nails look like underneath the acrylic nail. <laughs> Great for your nails. Also, if you can't tell, my room is very messy. Because I just went on sort of a vacation to this, um, like, Jesus Christ, to this, like, roller coaster park. And everything's kind of a mess, but at the same time, everything's kind of always a mess in my room, so. Not really an excuse. Do candles make like the like a screaming sound when you light them. Do candles have feelings? Are we like making them suffer? This is um from Target and it kind of smells like Play-Doh. So and I got coconut. it because it was the only one there for like three dollars, and it smells nostalgic. And this one is leather scented, and even though I'm vegetarian, I still like the scent of leather candles. I don't know why. So we lit all of our candles with this trendy lighter with handcuffs on it. It's from my brother's car. I don't know why he has a lighter in his car exactly. Marijuanas. Now but I'm not going to ask. to take some precautions. We're going to use scotch tape, I guess, to tape off our, like, finger part. But we're going to try to be safe and when our finger's protection. getting pregnant. That doesn't make any sense. I think I actually, with this claw, on accident, okay? Um, so my mom is probably gonna be home in like 15 minutes. So I'm trying to hurry so that she doesn't like murder me when she gets home. I'm struggling. I just like burn my finger off. Put them on fire, I guess. This is a bad idea. I'm getting scared. I'm okay. Um, so that one did not burn my finger, but the other one kind of stung. Oh my god. Oh my god. Candles on my nails. Jenna Marbles. <coughs> Playing with paraffin wax. Okay. This is <coughs> not smart. Okay. I'm scared. I think I'm gonna light the shank on fire and then I'm gonna be done.
Don't worry, Mom. No boys want to see this face. So, uh, I don't really know how to get the smell of burn acrylic out of my room before she gets back, but... Uh, none of my fingers got burnt, so that's good. I think the thumbnail is either going to be me going like this or like this. Okay, <clears throat> so update. I tried soaking them in acetone. Well, not acetone, but nail polish remover because we don't have acetone. So, another update. I got all of the nails off and my nails underneath don't look so hot. 